Hi guys, it's it's me, Peter One More Scoot for Life. Um, today I'm not doing a scooter video or, or a cinnamon challenge thing. Um, I'm doing a case review for an iPod 4G. Um, I got it off of eBay for about like five bucks. It's really cool. I got the Game Boy silicone case, and yeah, it's it's really it's really cool. It's thick like an iPhone 4. Um, it, the buttons, they actually stick out. It's not like the stupid printed, printed one, ones, so yeah, and it has these things. I'll get to that after. Um, when I opened the package, it was really soft, like, they, the first thing that came to my mind when I was touching it, like, it was really soft. It, it's not like normal rubber cases, and it's, yeah, it's, it's rubber so you can, like, squish it and stuff. Um, it has the Nintendo Game Boy right there, the A and B buttons, and, um, like, all that stuff, the start select, I'm pretty sure this is where the speaker is for the actual Game Boy, and the camera cutout here, we'll get, we'll get to that after, it says the battery here, and it's green, it's kind of cool, and then here it says on and off. So yeah, on um, that. Um, as I said, it's as thick as an iPhone, so it's, it makes your iPod look like an iPhone. So it's pretty cool. And the volume buttons are circles. I'm um, sorry about that. It, it's actually circles. So yeah, it looks pretty cool. And now I'm gonna get my iPod and then yeah, I'm gonna put it on. Okay. So here's my iPod. And. I'm gonna put it on. Oh, it's kind of hard to put it on with one hand because I'm recording. Okay, nice and tight. Okay, so, oh, whoops. As you see, it is really good. It makes your iPod look really cool. And, um,. Yeah, it's just the, the thing I love about it is how thick it is. It's it makes your iPhone feel like an iPhone 4. Um, yeah. So the buttons, um, it's kind of hard to press the buttons. Well, you can press, you can still press it, but it's just not the easiest. So if you press right on the thing here, you can still press it, but like it's just because your the thing is on a slant, the button. So yeah, it's kind of hard, but it's fine. You, you can still press it, and the volume, the volume, you can still adjust it, it's still good, so that's good, um, here, as I said, it's just the speaker for a game, like, the, for, for the real Game Boy, and it just shows a bit of your iPod, so, like, if you go to, like, the beach or something, maybe some sand can get in, but, like, it's fine, I wouldn't bring it to the beach, um, the camera cutout is perfectly good, and um, I'll show you that right now. So as you can see, it's it's perfectly fine. I'm just gonna take a random picture. Yeah, see, it's so it's totally fine. It's good. You don't see anything, but um, for the if you have an iPhone, you get the iPod silic. I mean, the iPhone silicone case, just like this one, but for an iPhone four with the flash and everything. You can take a picture with the flash in the dark. Then you'll see like a little glare because the flash is like right there, and then yeah, so it's okay, I guess, for the iPhone. But yeah, um, all the stuff here the speaker, the charger, and the headphone jack is perfectly fine. But um, when you put the, the charger thing in, it pushes this up a bit. So what I do is I just take my ca the case off and then charge it so yeah that's kind of okay another thing is um the headphone jack it works perfectly fine but if you have like the headphones where they're like this hold on let's get my headphones where they're um it has it's long like this then it won't fit i don't think well, I haven't... Oh, it does, maybe. Oh, well... Well, actually, no, it doesn't really fit well. As much as, like, the Apple iPhones, like, the EarPods or something like that. 
but it still it definitely still works. So yeah. So yeah, it looks really cool. It's probably the best case I've ever got. So um yeah, that's the iPod silicone case. Silicone iPod case. Thanks for watching. Bye.